It is considered one of the most effective COVID-19 vaccines. Now, scientists say they've hacked the genetic sequence behind Moderna's revolutionary mRNA vaccine and shared the code with the world online for free. The Stanford University researchers sequenced Moderna's patented drug by studying leftover vaccine vials with permission from US authorities. mRNA is the key mechanism used in the vaccine. It triggers the body's own cells to produce the protein needed to defeat the coronavirus. Now, DW's Amir Isif has been following uh, this story for us. Amir, does this mean we can all start mixing our own vaccine at home very soon? No, unfortunately not. It may seem that way given um, where they posted this, to GitHub, which is a place that has garnered attention for being a kind of hacktivist website where activists can post reverse engineered um, computer software code so that people can download it for free and in the public good. And so these scientists posted their code, which is mRNA code, a biological code, not a computer code, onto this website. But mRNA is a complex biological product that can't be downloaded like a computer program. It involves a huge supply chain, and there's even some steps involving nanoparticles that only a few hundred people in the world even know how to do, let alone have the option to do that with the help of a big company like Moderna. So we're not going to see any home-brewed vaccines anytime soon, I don't think. Unfortunately, I'd be one of the first to try. Uh, th what was, what's behind this project then? Well, their uh, explanation was just as simple. They said that this is a biological component that exists now in a pretty big part of the human population. And they say researchers have a right to know what it looks like. So um, they've found out what the code was using uh, just leftover material in these uh, vaccine vials and posted online because they said, uh, in particular, people who are researching COVID-19 um, should be able to distinguish between what mRNA is coming from the human body, what is coming from a virus, and then what is coming from this particular particular synthetic um, Moderna mRNA sequence. But this sequence, is it not Moderna's intellectual property? Have they said anything in reaction? Well, it is and it isn't. It's their intellectual property to create it. But just to know what it is, it's like if you took a microscope and you looked at uh, a BMW, what are the components of mm. the car? So that's all these scientists did. They said, here's what we found. This is how it's made. Um, but Moderna has actually been pretty lax in going after copyright violations, patent violations. They've even, the president of the company gave an interview and said that they're not going to um, go after patent violations. Um, and the scientists notified Moderna before they did this and there was no protest from the company. Our reporter, Amir Asif, thank you.